Hey folks, I don't know if any of you have ever been stung by one of these, but if you have, I promise you, you're not going to forget it. I just stepped on this thing in my living room floor, and luckily I had my shoes on. Uh, I've been unlucky quite a few times over the years. These things hurt. Uh, I've heard people explain that they, they feel like uh, someone holding a cigarette to your skin, and I'm here to tell you that's exactly what they feel like. I'm not sure what species uh, of scorpion this is, but it's we have a lot of these around here. I, I kill uh, quite a few around the place uh, throughout the year. Typically in the real cold weather, you don't see many of them, and but sometimes they'll it'll the cold or the extreme heat or dry uh, conditions will drive them indoors. I try to. I, I hate spraying poison around the house, but if you if you don't put a little bit out from time to time I, around here, I guarantee you, you're going to have a uh, a mess of these things out in the country. And I, I promise you, they hurt. Uh, I'm going to just kind of show you, give you a reference. That that stick right there, that's a that mark is at an inch. Uh, this is probably about the average size that that we get around here. I've had them a lot bigger than this and some a lot smaller. And I've probably, over the last, I don't know, 10 or 12 years, I've probably been stung by these things 15 or 20 times. And uh, it burns like crazy for about 10 or 15 minutes and then it'll ease up and it stays tender for a while. But I, I can promise you they'll get your attention. I've had them wake me up in my sleep stinging me on my back, my inner thigh, and everything else, and uh, there ain't just a whole lot you can do other than just wait for them to, or wait for the sting to let up, but anyway, I just thought I'd run your day here and show you something that uh, you may not even want to see. Anyway, thanks for watching.